everyone and welcome to another video in my channel. Today I decided to do decluttering my makeup and jewelry because I always do it twice a year. So one in the beginning of the year and another one in the middle of the year. So my clothes, I already declutter when I was changing house. So I declutter in November. I gave some of them to a charity and the other one is in a bag for my sister. Uh, for me to ha uh, give her to her. So today I'm only going to show my makeup and jewelry decluttering. I don't think I have a big uh, collection in both of them. I don't even call it a collection, but you can decide if it's big or not. You can see my wire, I know, but it's just for you to catch me better and not just my face. So I will show you everything of my beauty like stationary or something like that i don't know so let's go into it so i will let you hear because this is where are my stuff of your beauty and i will show you one by one by category and I will be decluttering. I think it's better to do by category, but let's see if I can do it by that because I have many things in other places, not everything by category. So let's see. I will start with my primer. So I only have one primer and I will stay. It's the Fenty Beauty one. So that is going to stay because I only have one. And speaking on primers, I have one eye primer. This is a new one, I never use it, so I will be having him for a while just to try on. And setting sprays, the same, I only have one. This is the Milani uh, Make It Last, so I will stay with it. Then let's go to foundations. I only have two foundations. I have my favorite foundation of all time. This is Born This Way from Too Faced. This is a new bottle, so it will be staying. And I love this foundation. I think it's the one that I love the most from all of the ones that I tried. So this is staying. And then we have this stick foundation, which is from Colourpop. And it is the, let me check. Uh, the no filter stick fair in 27 neutral and I only try twice and I didn't like how it's like on my skin so I'm going to give this one because only twice I bought it like two months ago I'm not reaching for it so it's better to give to another person that will use it so that goes on the side so that is concealers now I have one concealer in use, is the Too Faced uh, Born This Way as well. So this is staying, of course. And if I'm not mistaken, I have another concealer that is not in use, but I can show you. So this is the Tarte uh, Double Duty Beauty and the Sharp Tate. So I bought this to try because everyone raves about this, so I wanted to see if it's better than the ones that I love. So I do like a lot the Too Faced one, but my absolute favorite is the one from Catrice that is super cheap. So I will try this one after I get through the Too Faced one. So that's it. This is a little bit... Yeah, I will let it like this. It's fine. So let's pass it to cheeks. Chick, chick, chicks. So I will start with bronzer because I only have two bronzers and I will having them both. One is the Butter Bronzer from Physicians Formula and I love this one. This is my absolute favorite. As you can probably see, this is the most used one. I love it and I will have them until it finished. And then I have this one that I um, got like one month ago, the Fenty Beauty one, the mini version, version, sorry, uh, the Shady Biz. So this is a little bit darker for me, but I do like it and I can work with it. So I will have him still. I will just put the bronzers together. And because it's a small version, it's fine to travel because the physician's formula is too big for traveling. 
So let's go to blushes because I only have two blushes. Yeah, basically. So it's the Butter Bronzer, the Physician Formula uh, Plum Rose, which is lovely. I like it. However, I reach more for the next one that I will show you. And probably because of that, I will be giving that away. The other is from Too Faced, Papa Don Peach. And this is the one that I love the most uh, from these two. But my absolute favorite, and I want to buy it again, is from Milani and is uh, Luminoso. And I do like more the peachy ones than roses ones. So yeah, I will be giving this maybe to my sister. She will like it for sure. So I have one that they say that is a blush, but this color, it doesn't seem like a blush. And this is a new one, so I haven't like tried it yet. And this is the Burt Bees blush in Toasted Cinnamon. It's still new, that's why it's in this part of my little box, because this is the things that I have new ones and I haven't tried it yet, so that's it. And this is a three in one, let's say, from Pixie. It's the Gilbert Glow. Uh, pixel glow cake i think it was that gliddle bear glow yeah and they say that it's three in one so this seems more like a highlighter yeah then other thing is still i haven't like touched it but yeah i am excited to try this one and let's go to my favorite part of makeup to be really honest, that is uh, highlighters. I will start with the ones that I have in use. So I have one from Fenty Beauty. It's a small one again. So it's a travel one. This is the Hustler Baby. So I do like it. It's really cute. Uh, it's not like my absolute favorite, but I really like this one. And another mini that I have is the Becca. Uh, this is the Champagne Pop, if I'm not mistaken. No, sorry, this is the Opal. So this is a small version. I think like highlighters is better to buy like small versions. I haven't used this one, to be honest, but it's here for me to try. Then I have my absolute favorite. So this is my favorite one. It's from Colourpop and it is the collection that they made with Kathleen Lights and is on the cusp. This is my absolute favorite. That's why I have another one here below, like full already, because if they discontinue, I will be very sad. So I am this one. I'm already eating pan on this because I use it like almost every day. So then I already have one for when it gets um, finished, this one. I have one liquid one from Becca as well. This was last year, um, like together from Christmas. So that's why I have it. I haven't used it yet. As you can see, like I do ro love a lot of this. So that's why I will stay with them in here. And then I have one that I bought this year on Christmas. Let me see how I open this. This is the Fenty Beauty, uh, the How Many Carrots. I really like this one. I haven't tried it yet, but just watching it, it's just gorgeous. I think it's really gorgeous. So I am excited to try this one. Let's see how it will be. And the last one is a palette of <laughs> highlighters. I told you, I do love highlighters. And I do have too many. And this is a collection with Pixie and Rachel Loves. I love this uh, YouTuber. That's why I bought it because I wanted to support. And this is the Layers Highlighting Palette Glow On. And ooh, yeah, I will get it that after. And it brings five highlighters. You can customize whatever you want or use them by themselves. So I'm really excited to try this and I will get that after I film this. So I do still have another one, but this is like, I used this twice and this from Disney Villains with Colourpop in the color Maleficent, Mistress of All Evil. I do like it, but 
I do prefer this one. So I have already too many highlighters. I will be giving this to my sister if she wants it or to another person. So I will finish this because this is all that I have down here. And then I still have another cheek palette, so I will show you that straight away. And this is my like gift from two years ago, not last year, because we are already in 2020. So this was from 2018. I bought it uh, f like a gift from me to me. <laughs> and this is the ambient lighting edit unlocked because it is their... Um, First palette, I think, uh, like um, cruelty free. I think it's like this. If I, if it's not, please correct me down below. And I do like to support those things. So we have blush, we have highlighters, we have powders, and we have a bronzer. Like for me, this is not a bronzer. This is more highlighter. And I do really love to use the powder, and even this one the blush i do like it and i like to do the same with uh highlighters this is a beautiful palette and you can like try the the brand so this is why i bought it i do use it as much i use this highlighter i try to always use both of them so yeah i do have too many uh highlighters but let's see what i do from now, I will only be giving one away, or maybe two. I will think about it until the end of this video, <laughs> to be really honest. And so that's his face. Yeah, that's face. And let's go to eyes. So I only have one brow product, and this is the Archery, Archery, yeah, two-in-one brow uh, from the Soap and Glory. I do like it, it's not like my favorite product, but yeah, I do like it. I will try to use it up. And that's it. Then mascaras, I only have two. So this is one of my favorites and the pink one as well. But I think I prefer this one. And it's the Princess Lash from Essence. Uh, they have three of them. I think it's one purple, one pink, and this the green. I do like this formula and I think it's a great price for the products. That's why I have a bigger version of it than anything else. They don't do mini versions, unfortunately. And that's why, because when I'm going to travel, I want to use a mini one. I don't want to be carrying a lot of full things. So that's why I have the Too Faced Better Than Sex and it is really good. I will not lie, it is really good. I only tried in 2019 and I always like, oh, people just talk about this, but probably it's not that good. It is really good. I did like it. I only think it's expensive, like the mini version. At least it's 12 euro for this but it's fine, like only bigger brands do mini versions, not the drugstore brands, unfortunately. So that's it. And I have one powder that I will not take from here, but it's their RSMA uh, powder. This just gets all over the place and I will have it forever because that doesn't finish. I am already using for one year and it's still like here. So yay. Uh, like eyeshadows, I have two liquid eyeshadows, I think it's just two. Yeah, and this is the Colourpop collection with Zoella. Uh, this is the OG and this is the Bellini. I do like this just when I don't want to do nothing on the eyes, like eyeshadows, like working with them. And I just pop this on the eye and eyelid and that's it, I'm ready to go. Uh, so eyeshadows, I have two palettes. This is the Milani uh, Bold Obsessions. And this is a beautiful eyeshadow palette. There is a lot of colors that you can work with. So I will be staying with this, this because I don't have many palettes of eyeshadows. And the last one, I bought it like three months ago. And this is the Too Faced Hot Buttered Rum. This smells fantastic, to be honest, and this is just coppery eyeshadows. That is my favorite eyeshadows, is coppery ones, and this is a good size to travel as well. 
so I think only is missing lips. <laughs> so I will start with the new one that my boyfriend offered me for Christmas. I we didn't did like Christmas presents, but he knew that I wanted this. So he bought me this for Christmas. Is the Charlotte Tilbury the gift of pillow talk lips and it brings one mini pencil and the the lipstick. So I will have it here until I finish this part and then I will put them in there to the collection because now I have to choose which goes. So I will start with this one that didn't fit in there. This is the Villains uh, Ursula and is a matte um, lipstick and this is Colourpop again with Disney. <sighs> I wanted to love because I love the color, however it is matte and it is like drying matte. So I'm not using it, I only tried once, I didn't like in my lips and so I will be giving it because my sister loves matte ones so she will like that one for sure. Then I have this new one as well. I really wanted this one because it's another collection with a YouTuber and this is Mr. Morris and it is from Colourpop again I love this packaging I really love this packaging and the color is a brown one and I wanted to try a brown one I don't have this type of colors unless it's another one that I have and I will show you I can show you now so this is staying because it's a new one and the other one is from, a uh, brown one is from Fenty Beauty and it's already like so dirty. Um, and this is, let me check, Unveil. I think that's the color. And yeah, it's a liquid matte and it's a good one. Um, then from Fenty as well, I have the gloss. This is the only gloss that I have. I used to hate glosses because <laughs> my hair gets on the gloss and I do not like this. Of course, this is the same. My hair gets on the gloss if I don't have it pull away uh, from my face, but I love this on the lips. So that's why I still have it and I will have it. This is so gorgeous. And I think this came with the highlighter. So it's mini versions. And I really, really love this. So yeah, so... I do have this one that is from Lancome and it is the color Beige Vintage. Uh, I used to love this and now I don't use it anymore. So let me smell if it's still good. Mm. It doesn't smell the same so probably it's out so this will be going. Uh, yeah, unfortunately. And then this is my only lipstick from MAC and when this uh, finish I will not buy it again unfortunately but yeah I love this color it's a color that suits me I really love it I wanted to find a dupe and this is the retro satin retro so yep that's it I will be like having it until it's just finish and then I will not buy it again. So then from Colourpop I have LBD cream and this is a gorgeous color. I do like this for the winters and this is a collection with uh, Becky G. I love her so that's it. By the way I will already put this like this in here. I do have another lipstick from Colourpop with Kathleen Lights and it's what's your sign and it's on my purse because that's the one that I love the most so it's there so it will be staying there then I have this pixie one um, so this is matte beige in liquid uh, lip matte last so I haven't tried it yet I will because I really think the color is beautiful then what I have here I have this one from Jeffree Star and I haven't used it as well so this is the Christmas cookie. Yeah, Christmas cookie. So it was more for the name. So I hope it's like gorgeous, to be honest. And I have another one from Jeffrey. 
star and Shane Dawson. And to be honest, I used this once and I thought like, because I searched a lot about these colors before I buy, uh, buy it. And to be honest, like, <laughs> the color was so gorgeous in swatches from other YouTubers. And then when I tried it, I didn't like that much, but I will try it again because I only use once and see if I like it or not. So that will be going here. And I have this one from Colourpop with Shayla and this is the Slowdown. I never used this one, but I think I already have too many of these colors, so I will be giving this. Uh, let's see what I have more. I have these two. I have the Zoella with Colourpop in little one. I love this color. I really like this color, so I will be having it. And then I have a Nabla one, and this is in the color Melrose. This is a gorgeous color as well. Uh, but to be honest, I don't go, like, I don't get this one as much as others. So probably because I only want, like, use it once or twice, I will be giving it as well because I don't want to stay with many things and then they just go to waste. And I have two uh, lip pencils. This is the little one with Zoella as well. So yeah, I can put them together just to pair them. And then I have the Nabla one in Melrose as well. Uh, and I do like this, so I will be staying with it uh, because I use it. Like I use it more than the liquid lipstick. So I will use that one instead. And this goes here because they don't fit straight in there. And I will be taking this and putting in the spot in there. And this as well. So this is a mini one. So maybe I put here just for me to see it. And so this is rubbish. I will throw it away. <laughs> And so that's it on makeup here. Yeah. So I think it's not much as you can see. Let me check if I want to give anything else. I think this, because I didn't use it yet, I can give it to my sister. So she can choose between one of them and or give to anyone. That's gorgeous. Like this is a gorgeous color, I, I'm sure of it. But I have so many highlighters, so many. They will get me through like life. And probably I don't need this one anymore because I have this one for travel. This one is a good one for travel. When I went to Greece, I just bought it with me because it's not a bad size. I love it. I really like go and buy this one if you want to experiment something like this is so amazing. This is the most loved one. And I can stay with this color in liquid because I don't have any liquid highlighter. And yeah, probably that's it. So that's it. I don't know if I do now the, the jewelry one or if I do it in another video. Probably it's better in another video. Just, yeah, probably it's better because this will be like too much already. So this is the end of our video. I know that I said that I will do the jewelry one, but I think this is already too big for just this small collection. So if you want to see the jewelry one, just leave it in the comments and I will do it next time in the next video, okay? So just let me know and that's it for today. I hope you like this video and we see each other in the next one. Bye.